Hey everyone, and welcome back to another game of Catan. I am the Wanderer, and today we are playing another ranked game on our Road to Top 100 this season. And we have the second pick. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so immediately Red takes the uh, the 8.10.5, which locks up all the ore. Um, I'm just trying to think here what I do. Uh, I think I'm probably going to have to take either the 9.10.5 or the, the 6.9.5. The reason that I don't like the 6.9.5 is because, one, the ore port's not great for me. Uh, and two, uh, we could potentially get play out there. The 8.510 is very interesting to the brick port. Um, I almost think that becomes a pretty viable option. What else have we got? There's the 9.64 here. Don't love it with the ports, though. I still think it could be this, but I almost want to point left because I have a feeling this might be open. Plus, I can build my way over to the 3 to 1 uh, if I take the 9.65. Uh, my outs on the way back, I just need sheep. Now, I could also take this 8.34 uh, in thoughts that I definitely get wheat on the way back. But then also, I just, I really kind of like this 9.65. I think I get some sort of something like, you know, around this 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 sheep. Uh, I'm going to have roadway, like road pathway if I go through here. I think I've got to take it. It may seem like a bit of a trap here, but I think it's the right play. Um, also, just wanted to say, uh, obviously, for anyone who saw the last video, uh, I appreciate all the, the kind comments on there. Uh, it was just, yeah, I feel like I was on track to reach a top 100 potentially in either 1v1s or the four player this season, and it really just fell off hard. But again, all your supportive comments are very appreciative, appreciative of, uh, and I'm glad you're all enjoying the content. We have nearly hit 2,000 subs. Got about 50 more to go at this rate. So uh, for everyone who's watching and hasn't subscribed, if you'd like to, I'd super appreciate it. Uh, and yeah, we'll just stay tuned for some more fun content. Uh, while we're waiting for Black, I'm going to have a look at their profile. I think they've got to take that 843 or spot, by the way, because uh, they will get weed on the way back. Uh, only 21% win rate and 1800 global. Uh, blue is... Blue is... Blue is... Only 19 games, but only a 15% win rate. Did they play last season? 31% win rate and finished 204 global. Only 66 games, though, but obviously can play. I think I've played against Red before. That name sounds familiar. Uh, Red. Ooh, that's taking a little while to load. There we go. 23% uh, win rate and only 67 games. So, not as strong as I've been playing against recently, but we all know that that doesn't make a difference with me sometimes. Uh, let's see what happens. Ooh, interesting. So, Black's taken the 964 there, which is a super strong spot, but they're leaving... I think oh, just, just I think um, I think blue has to take some combo of like eight four three nine probably eight four three nine ten eleven actually. Uh, in fact, that's a no brainer. Eight four three nine ten eleven. Yep, eight four three. Oh, and gone eight five ten. I suppose they're thinking free road. I can get to the wheat this way, and then I've got pretty strong everything. So yeah, I think slow play from blue, but that all port comes in handy. Uh, meaning that now black here pretty much has to take uh, the, the probably the six three eleven I'd say. The only thing is they're locked. They are locked out of the ore, so they could potentially try and do the five four eleven to the eight four three. But they've surely got to know that that will get taken. So I think black just takes this and maybe races me to the six the six eleven twelve. They could also do the 6-11-3, and they could take the free road and plow blue. But blue does have that free road, but black will play first. So, yeah, okay, there you go. Makes sense. Now, I'm looking for the the, the sheep ore, right? So, I think it has to be this. Uh, it gives me the road path, and what does uh, what does red take? Yeah, red probably just takes the 5-4-11, which is just super good for them, too. 5, 4, 11. Oh, red setup is just mental. But what, what can I do? I can't I can't really take away from it because if I take this, they still get the brick road to start um, and they get the extra wheat. Oh, this is crazy. Red's just going to have a wild setup here. So red is going to uh, have a wild setup. I'm just going to put that out there because I can't take this. I need to take this and I the brick port's just too good for me. It's just too good. Um, the problem is, we do lose our road connect. Um, maybe I should have done this and f taken... Actually, you know what? Maybe I should have gone without the ore. Maybe I should have taken this, taken the free road to here, and forced red onto this. Because I don't think red ever takes the 843 there. 
Oh, they might though. Okay, so red does what we thought. Uh, they probably dropped that road straight away too. Um, that's fine. I think we have to be hitting red here. And it's got to be on the 8. Uh, I'll just say uh, wood for non-steel. Yeah, blue says no, I'm going to hit red anyway. Uh, doesn't matter. Uh, all good. Uh, I'd say I, I didn't... Uh, that's fine. I'm happy to get the sheep there. It's not bad. And we should roll wood anyway as we roll the five. Black plows blue. We roll the eight again. Blue will drop their road here. I think for me, first first port is the brick port. I do sheep for wood here. I don't need the brick. Yep, yeah, they just dropped the road. Another five. Okay. So we're just full of brick. There's a six. Nice. Uh, I don't think we ever worry about this road first. I think it's just straight to the brick port. And that's the five rolls. We get this. We probably double up on the wheat next after that. Let's roll another eight. Jeez, this brick port would be nice to have already. Black us for two cards here. He might get this off blue. No? Okay. Blue has the blick, the blick, the brick in hand. Black's right, he should be charging two cards here. Blue, four for ones for the wheat. I suppose they, they don't have any. Damn, we lose. I think we just drop this. In fact, I think we even keep the sheep and just drop all the brick. Now, red probably blocks the eight, I'd say. It's not a good block because neither of us care. It's more, actually, the six is probably a better block. He probably does that. Yeah, and he probably hits me just for hitting him earlier, but fair enough. As red, I don't... Yeah, we lose the sheep. That's fine. As red, I don't really know who the who and I would be thinking is the next biggest threat after after them, obviously. Maybe... Yeah, blue has no wheat yet. Uh, black... I just don't see how black wins this game at the moment. They have no ore. Uh, and the sheep port's not going to be that great. And I just... Yeah, I don't, they don't have road. They're going to have to port for all the devs. I just don't see how black wins this game. That is a huge trade. Like, I'd definitely consider it if I had the wood. Uh, red just pops dev. We roll a nine. I don't think I have a pop here. Uh, I kind of want to, but I really need to get that brick port down. Unfortunately, my brick, oh, my wood is blocked. I'm just going to have to pray for some sevens here. Perfect. Okay, so black should block the eight. Okay, five. That's also fair enough. I just don't know if that's the right block. It still hurt. definitely hurts red. And he steals some red. Okay. Um, I guess, though, you can't fault it in the sense that it does hurt red and it does, obviously, disadvantage blue and myself, even though we have the eight. I still think this is better, as it prevents red from devving. It ends up just popping a dev instead, as we roll four. Okay, he's looking for a six now. If I can get myself on here, I'm pretty happy. Wow, red doesn't have a knight, but they they roll a seven. That's two sevens in a row. Now, does red think, oh, I've got to block blue here? So, if he does, he might block the eight. I still think he blocks a six, though. Oh, actually, the nine. The nine's a good block. Do I get hit again? Oh, I do. That's a, that's a shocking steal, too. Ooh, Red might play the aggro knight here. Now it gets the trade. Okay. We roll a three. It's a good roll for us, but we, we really need this settle, and losing that wheat there was brutal. And if somehow it happened, if blue backdoor cut us to that, honestly, I'd probably cry. Oh, we roll the six. Nice. Okay, I wonder if I could trade black here. Uh, I could potentially trade black some ore for that wheat. Uh, ore for wheat. I could do two here, just not the wood. Black takes that. I think I've got to take it. I just need to... I have a, a stuck hand here. Uh, and I really had to do that. And I can actually pop a dev here now, which is really handy. Yep. Okay, road building. Interesting. Okay. Black gets the settle. Six rolls. Okay, so with the road building... 
I'm just trying to think what the best move is. Do I go to more wheat and take myself down to the 6-3 as opposed to doubling up on the 9? I think that might be better. The 6-3 doubles up the ore. I get 2 wheat, which makes my wheat unblockable. Um, I think this might be the play. And I probably almost fish the roads out there this turn just so black doesn't decide to cut back this way. This also gives me a chance at road because I can extend up and around here. I can go down this way if black doesn't get to here or like, you know, if I get to here, it gives me like, what's that? Four roads, five roads, six roads, seven roads, eight roads, nine roads, 10 roads, 11 roads. So it's like, I have a pretty decent uh, road path that way. Blue drops a road out, two roads out to the three for one. Interesting. 10 rolls. Plays the aggressive knight. He said, "We he might." I'm hoping he doesn't realize that I have the wood, and he goes after blue here because blue just got two. Yeah, he doesn't realize. Okay, and red pops a dev. We roll the twelve. Uh, I am gonna fish the road out there now. I don't think black ever. Let's just do that. We'll pass. And the nine rolls. Nice. Okay, the eight's an annoying block given my port, but uh, we still have the five. Okay, black drops a road to the sheep port. I don't think, he, I mean, he could bother trying to plow me, um, which, would, which would be really annoying because uh, I really want the wheat. I don't really care. Like, the extra ore is good. I mean, I, worst case scenario, I do go to the wood port, which isn't the worst thing in the world. As so we roll the five, okay, looking for a four now, and we can get this settle off. Red cities. Okay, so that should take all the attention off me. Okay, let's roll. Uh, I'll say uh, sheep for another block. I think someone's got to have sheep, right? Blue and red have zero. Let's see if black has it. I want to block this eight. I think I still have to block that. I think I still hit red here. Brick is fine. That means I can port it. And the nine rolls, okay. Any eight, five, four gives me this settle. I'd be shattered if black had a yop or a row building and plowed me. Black just pops a dev instead. All right, 10 rolls. Looking for some eights here. Problem is, I'm I think red had definitely has a knight, so we're going to get blocked here. Do two cards here. I don't think blue has the sheep though, because the four hasn't rolled. That's kind of tempting. He ends up just porting for the brick and plows red, which really helps. And the eight rolls too. Okay, nice. Red ports for the ore and passes. Oh, we roll a four too. Lovely. Um, let's just take the settle here. I could port and go down to the sheep port, but I just don't think it's that useful for me. And I still think it doesn't help black that much. So let's just take this uh, and we'll pass. Now I need a city. Six rolls. I suppose that the, the, the like plowing there doesn't do really do anything because black just would drop that extra road, I think. Um, yeah, I, I just, I honestly don't care about this spot at the moment. I have my port. Um, I can go to the wood port if I need another one. And I'm really only gonna have, I guess, I guess I'll have more wheat now, but one three roll here is just huge. And then I think I city up the nine, six, five to balance my uh, wheat with this ore plus the extra brick here, balancing the wood with the brick. Definitely, I think it's the nine six five. And honestly, if black can't get this settlement off, I think I'd, I could fucking plow. Oh, that gives me road for days. I think they should be able to port for this settlement. They end up porting for the ore instead in passing as we roll another six. Okay, blue gets a settle. Eleven rolls. Red drops of road. I guess they're going to make their way to the port here. Yeah. Oh, we roll a four too. Um, I wonder if... Does anyone have brick? Uh, wood, I mean. I could do a wheat for a wood here and I could actually plow black. No? Okay. I think I am actually just going to port for the ore here. Uh, I think I've got to pop a dev too. Yeah. Okay. Yop is handy. That should make that city much easier. Black seven's out too. Now, I think you've got to be hitting blue almost. 
Like blue and red. It hits the nine. I guess the nine's fine. It doesn't bother me now that I'm onto the six. He does steal from blue. And he ports and should city here, I think. Yeah, okay, that's a big city for black. Eight rolls. Okay. We have the city now with that yop. See, this is where I'm torn, right? Because I have the city in my hand. But I almost think this plow makes more sense because it probably cements me road long term. And the sheep port is not really that useful. But then the city is just so handy. Maybe the city is just better. Yeah, maybe the city is just better. Okay, head cities again. Yeah, I think we fall too far behind in production otherwise. So let's just port for this. And for this. And I actually think it's still the 965. Even though the nine's blocked right now, the, the five becomes a huge roll. The six is so handy. Um, I think I'm going to pass here. As the eight rolls. Hopefully black's not sitting on a mono. Nope, they just port for the brick and pass. Five. Oh, we have the plow here. If we don't seven out, we can plow to the 6-2, the which becomes big. Because it means we take road. And we settle. It puts us on eight. Blue gets a city. Okay. Six rolls again. I'm hoping red doesn't have a mono. No, I can't be trading here. As much as that's a good trade for me, plowing black here makes the most sense. Oh, that's also a good trade. But again, with the hand that I've got, I just don't think I take it. I gotta take that. Oh, he ends up doing the trade with black over me. Uh, I guess I can understand why. Got to not seven out here. Okay. Ah, oh, that's of course. Um, I guess I do that. I'm just gonna say uh, sheep for non-block question mark. Does anyone have any sheep? Black says zero. Otherwise, it's just the eight, right? What does blue have? I don't know what blue has. Mm. I still think it's red. We get an ore. I'll try and do ore for sheep here. If anyone has it. No, okay. Uh, I think I'm going to have to port here for a dev. Damn, losing that player was kind of annoying. Oh, that's just such a ripper of a, um, oh, of a seven. Has the eight rolls, so good block. Okay, wood for brick here. Nah. Okay. Six rolls, nice. Black pass, so they're sitting on ten cards. Oh, we're literally a sheep away here. Red pops. So I think red must have a VP. Okay. Oh, that's two brutal seven outs. I think we have to ditch this. No, I think we ditch the wood. Um, black has to seven out too, which is nice. But I th I have to seven out, has to discard. I think it's still red though, right? I think red is just by far the best suited here. Um, it's got to be the five. Hit red. We get a brick. Nice. Uh, I could port and pop here. Yeah, I think I might. If I get a knight, I think I almost play an aggressive knight here and block the eight again. And hit red. Get wheat. Okay, nice. Eight rolls. Good block. Another five.
blue has to extend that way. Or it doesn't really extend, it just opens up a settle. It's the nine rolls. So reds, I'm just gonna say, uh, no knight red. They city. Ah, okay. I think I'm gonna have to obviously. Yeah, he blocks the nine, probably hits me here. After I've just explained that my blue is not a threat, but he does hit blue again. Uh, I've got to play the knight here because that eight roll just becomes way too scary. Get a brick. Okay. Oh, I could now. I've got to pop devs though, don't I? Because I need to have army. Oh my goodness. Um, uh, anyone have... Hmm. Red, if red can pop next turn, they win. Oh, I don't know what to do here. Do I just pass? I can't take road. Yeah, I'm going to have to pass. That's so annoying. Okay, black rolls a seven, so he should be hitting red again. Just go back to the five or the ten. Okay, that five is fine because it stops red from sneaking road. It's 100% red though. Oh, I feel like he's going to... I Just don't do it, Black. Don't make a silly decision. Okay, he hits blue. I don't know why. Blue is not the steal there. Red... Uh, Black Cities. as the eight rolls. Okay, what's blue going to do? I think blue probably just has to port for the settle. I need red not to get a roll here. A red can't pop a dev. Okay, blue ports and cities. Okay. I need red not to get a roll. They didn't. That's so big. Red can't pop here either. The problem is I'm stuck in the middle of road and army here. Ah, oh, he has the mono. Huge. Okay, that, that kind of forces my decision here. Uh, red Does red take road with that? Oh, jeez, like, I need a six now. I, like, oh, this is annoying. Because I don't think red can settle and take road. If I take road, okay. We roll the four as well. No way. That, that mono hurt me. Um, I guess I just pop a dev. We get the knight. They have army. The problem is his road's at six. So I guess I just do this. Oh, not that. I guess I just do this. And I drop the road here so that if red just doesn't get the rolls for a settle, which they probably will. Yeah, they're probably going to get it for a settle or a city here. The good thing is they haven't got a port, but they probably still get it. Black probably does this trade with blue. Got to be careful, though, because if blue does drop the settle and two roads, they win. Everyone genuinely has a chance in this game other than black right now. Ah, oh, what killed me before was that seven out that would have allowed me to play out here. That really killed me. Oh, he does the trade with blue. Oh, I don't know about that. So black gets the settle, finally. I hope they have a mono here, actually, to be honest. Oh, he uses road building. Interesting. Oh, if he cuts red off, that would be huge. Yes, nice. We just got to avoid red being able to win here. Is black not settling for a reason? He's got to place the other road. Oh, he probably just doesn't know where to place it. I think you just go this way, right? Yeah. We roll that. Uh, blue could win here. Do they have enough... Blue pops, and then they're going to pop again, or are they just going to take the settle? Or they take the city? Okay, good move there from... Ah, that's GG. I'd say GG, red. 
Ugh, we were one card off. One card. Oh, it's not one card, two cards, actually. We just needed the six, and we finished fourth. After all that, we finished fourth. Um, we'll look at the dice stats. Um, no. <laughs> Guys, I think this game just uh, sums up my season. Like, we had such a good position. We had such a good plan. A couple of bad seven outs, uh, and the nine's not rolling. That game really hurt me. Um, we'll look at the res card stats, the dev card stats. Yeah, it just killed me. That mono hurt me. Big, big mono there from red. Uh, let's see what happened here. And we'll look at the resource stats. So, yeah, we got frogs only twice, which is, I mean, we, we should never have really been robbed at that point. Um, our production was the best in terms of dice, but then we were blocked. Um, how much, what was this? Is the activity stats where you see how much, yeah. Uh, oh, we didn't have that much income blocked either. Yeah, we were just unlucky. Those seven outs was the ones that killed us. Which is the one where you find out how much you had to ditch? Is it in resource stats? I can't remember. Oh, anyway, it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, look, what do we lose for that one? Minus six. Yeah, it's just been that kind of season. But look, that was an I thought that was an exciting game. We were pretty damn close. Um, I feel like we did what we had to do. We still didn't get there. But I hope you guys enjoyed that one. And uh, stay tuned for some more. We'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.